Hello everyone, welcome to Metrofile on Channels Television. Now this edition is particularly special, coming to you all the way from our Gombo Kingdom in Lagos State, Southwest Nigeria, where we've come to celebrate with your monarch, His Royal Majesty, Oba Muslim Abiodun Ogumbo, the Ogudu or Shadow the First of Ogumbo Kingdom. Now we are here at the palace where the celebration is going to start from and then we're going to move to the reception where he will be celebrating with members of his community. Now Metrofile is on ground to capture all the sights and sounds and then we'll bring it to you just the way you love it. But what we will advise is kindly watch out for sensitive images. Once again, welcome to the program. I am Oge Chuku Osi Oyeludi. Ogombo, a quiet community located in Etiosa local government area of Lagos State. The community whose major occupations include trading, farming and fishing is believed to have been founded on October the 4th, 1873 by Prince Abiodun Ogudu Okeoshadi, whose sculptural piece sits right in the middle of the town. Ever since it was founded, the town has been without a king, owing to some infighting that has lingered amongst the ruling houses. Only recently, precisely the 16th of August 2022, they got their very first king, an entrepreneur in the community who is the founder of Ashila Properties and Furnitures Limited, Oba Muslim Abiodun Ogumbo, Ogudu Oshadi I of Ogumbo Kingdom. Oba Ogumbo was elevated to the position of Oba and presented his staff of office by the Lagos State Government. A historic event for members of the community and the king, whose first task at that time was to reconcile all the warring families. There was differences in this community among the family um, before I acceded this position. But glory be to God that immediately I was installed position, uh, been able to settle the differences among the family. Uh, by now we are one family, no any dispute, no any differences among us. We are working together, we are thinking together, and we are raising together. Four months after he was installed, the royal father and members of the community are set to celebrate this historic event. very excited today to witness today and then if we look at the atmosphere of the community today you will see that everybody are really 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 happy for what's going on today how the people turned out today we are we are very happy to witness what's going on today uh, I give glory to Almighty Allah. The, he, he, without uh, his uh, you know, intervention, I'm not sure we've we'll been able to have, do what we are doing today. But glory to Almighty Allah. Being the first king of the community, figuring out how to serve his people according to him was easy owing to the fact that he was well accepted by his people, whom he has served in different capacities over the years. I know what they want, I know what they don't want. I mean, somebody that I accommodating people. As far as you are, can be tolerant with people, you can be able to bring them together. 
And then I didn't look at myself as a king of them. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at them as uh, their servant. As far as you see yourself as a servant, I believe you will serve them properly. I've been serving my people for a long time ago. I was the secretary of this community over 20 years before, after serving them good, and when they see my performances, they call me to be their ballet. I run the position of ballet for good uh, two years before I now elevated to their king. Few months down the line, the people are already feeling the positive impact of having their own traditional ruler. The reason they came out in their numbers to celebrate with him, all wearing matching outfits at the coronation reception. Yes, uh, if we look at Ogombo uh, community now, uh, I can invite people to come around 8 o'clock and see how I lighten the whole community. Single-handedly, single-handedly done by me, without even intervention of the government. And uh, by now, I believe I will still do more. With the support of my people, I will still do better, better, and more. I will advise the youth to shun any vices that will cause I work in the community and join hand with me to move this community forward. And I will also advise every stakeholders in this community to cooperate with me and to develop this Ogombo for betterment of the people that are residing in this community. God bless every one of us. It's vain within this short time, has brought a lot of infrastructural development to the community, has brought peaceful coexistence. During his reign, four months in reign, we never experienced anything like um, kidnappings, insecurity. What we have been witnessing since his reign is infrastructural development. The governor just built a school very close to this place, Ogombo Secondary School during his reign, which will be commissioned any moment from now, is a plus to him. We have Okombo Shomoto Edo Road going on right now, as we speak, and um, he has received numerous letters about um, infrastructural developments that are coming in to the community. So it's a plus, traditionally, it shows that eh, the gods accepted him. Just four months, he has been able to install street lights solar lights within the community, just how many months? With his own money. He has not started selling land. He has just been installed. Well, it all started in the palace, through the streets of the kingdom, and now we are at the venue for the reception of the traditional ruler of Ogombo Kingdom. Now everyone is celebrating the streets. It's, you know, it's the jubilant crowd on the street. Inside the hall is packed and everyone is expectant. Everyone is waiting for the arrival of the traditional ruler, His Royal Majesty, of our Muslim Abiodu Ogombo. <laughs> Finally over, and it's a royal arrival for their traditional ruler, 
Oba Muslim Abiodun Ogumbo Ogudu Oshadi the first. He was accompanied by other royal fathers and chiefs of the kingdom. <laughs> Shortly after, he was joined by his wife, Olori Rafiat and Oluakbo Ogumbo. <laughs> For the sons and daughters of Ogombo who came out in their numbers, this ceremony marks a significant milestone in the community. As it signifies progress, this is the first time Ogombo is getting an order. <laughs> Oh, 
Kota Gudoka Rosani Kepada Kota Gudoka Mana Kota Gudoka Alai Lua Mago Soria Lepa Kuki The hall was full, playing host to royal fathers from other kingdoms, including the representative of the Oni of Ife, other highly revered orbers, members of the Igbo, and other communities resident in Ogombo. I am delighted to welcome you all to Ogombo Kingdom, where you have come to participate with our Kabe on this unique occasion. We are very grateful to God, the Almighty Creator of the universe, for the life of our young and very first monarch, and on this on his behalf, and those of the good people of Ogombo. We have shared the physical presence of our amicable governors and other members of the team and at this coronation. Since he ascended the throne, the royal father has enjoyed tremendous goodwill from everyone who live and operate in the kingdom, irrespective of tribe, religion, and political affiliations. <laughs> Uh, 
I wish um, the newly crowned um, Uluwa for Gombo many, many more years on the throne of his forefathers. I wish him that um, his city, Ogombo, will develop tremendously during his reign and may his reign be peaceful. And I wish all the sons and daughters of um, Ogombo all the best. Congratulations to everybody. He has been playing the role of Oba before he became the Oba. He's a generous man. The community love him, they like him. Very gentle man to the call, humble. So, with, with God on our side, Ogonbo, in the next one or two years, the development will be rapid. The traditional ruler accompanied by his wife and other guests stepped forward to cut the cake. The people of Ogombo are indeed happy and celebrating with their new king. They have also promised to join him in moving their community forward 
towards greater development. It's been an amazing time on the show. Thank you for coming all the way to our Gomba Kingdom with us to celebrate with the traditional ruler and the people of the kingdom. Remember, you can watch this again and past editions of the show on our YouTube page. Follow us on all our social media handles and you can reach us with the number blinking on your screen. Thank you once again for watching. I am Oge Chukwasi Oyelude. From all of us here, it's goodbye from our Gomba. Kingdom.